Hey guys, what's going on? Stallion here with a big crate opening. It's double paint weekend. We got 80 keys, 80 players choice crates, and I got my good buddy Veal Bear Tooth, Alex, also in the party here. Hey guys, what's up? So, gonna have a fun time. Double paint weekend. We got 80 players choice crates. Probably the best possible crate, as you can get painted zombies or Dracos. Two awesome exotics. And four pretty cool mysteries. So, I think we need a good way to start this. And it's going to be with the Rocky theme song. Import on the first crate. Not I'm really uh, digging that choice of music. <clears throat> it gets the hype going. I'm really digging that. Yeah, definitely, man. I definitely dig that song for sure. Oh, I love the Let's Rocky hope for, uh, <clears throat> Just some, just a bunch of painted stuff. You know what I mean? Close to the hex, landed on unpainted Dracos. Oh. They didn't even hook you up with a certified one? Yeah, certified Dracos. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm a little delayed on the stream watching it, but... <clears throat> I'm just now seeing the uh, Dominus. <laughs> the first one you opened. I'm just now seeing it. Try to do a quick some reset unpainted real quick. Septums. That's not terrible. Can trade up to the very rare. We'll equip that. That can be the start to our car. Our goal at the end of the day is to have three categories that we've got on our car. Is to have wheels, a decal. Close to the specter. Wheels, a decal. And a boost? Yeah, and a boost. The hex phase is the only boost, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, hex phase is the only boost. <clears throat> oh, you were so close to that Spectre, man. So, we can get imports. Ideally, I'm not wanting to. Well, I mean, that's good trade-up fodder, you know what I mean? Although, you know, I'm not too against that Dominus. The Dominus probably looks the nicest out of all of them. Yeah, for sure. Rico Shibuya, not huge on these rares. Need that painted exotic or a heat wave or a 20XX. <coughs> we need a good we got pull. Tons of crates to go. We got unpainted Dracos again. Oh, that can take over instead of the septums. Haven't gotten much. Well, Still have plenty of crates. Right now. Pardon? How many crates you in? I think this is six. <clears throat> like how many got how many got left? Oh you're in, okay, you've already opened six. Okay. Shibuya. Yeah, I mean for the six crates, I mean you've gotten what? You've gotten an import, right? And two Dracos. <clears throat> and a paint a pair of painted septums. For six no, crates, that's no not paint on the too, too bad. Well, then you, I thought you got a pair of painted septums already. Nope. Oh, okay. I thought you I you said septums. My bad. Got a certified narwhal. So far, garbage stuff. Gotta get those imports. Painted exotic. You know what we're hunting for hey, is you know those big pulls. <clears throat> Don't call the narwhal garbage, man. The narwhals are amazing. <laughs> Octane MG8. Everyone out there knows it. There's our first deco we've got. Alright. I think I'm actually only like a few seconds behind when you uh, announce what you got. <clears throat> uh, you're like just opening that crate as soon as you announce what you got. So I'm not too far behind, but there's not really much I can do to fix that. There's our first boost. Got some paint on that. Looks like one of the worst paints, but painted hex face. 
have a look what color that is. Either orange or burnt sienna. That looks that looks orange. It looks too bright to be burnt sienna, but if that's burnt sienna, man, there's something weird with that boost. Orange. Not complaining with that. So ten crates in. Double paint weekend. Looking for painted exotics. Even mysteries. I like how you almost I like how you almost open up the uh, secret Santa. So, <laughs> that would have been a waste of a key. Or no, not secret Santa. Was those springtime fevers? Those are the yeah. green ones, right? <clears throat> yeah, that would have been a real waste of a key. Exactly. One thing I notice is how there's never going to be a terrible player's choice crate. Is because it's all of the top items mixed into one crate. All the fan favorites. I'm actually kind of excited to see when they, if they do release the a new player's choice crate, like uh, when they like re-roll all the items that are going to be inside of it. Kind of curious what they're actually going to be putting in there. As for rare decals, that's a complete toss-up. No one really knows. But uh, what do you think they'd probably put in there for the very rares, like the wheels and boosts? Like, what do you think would come back? I would hope not the troikas. Well, they haven't made it back into either of the player's choice crates that came around, so I doubt that they would make it back as a very rare wheel. Um, honestly, I I would be uh, still anticipating maybe some uh, nippers, and I don't realize I don't remember all the wheels that have came out in the past. I could I could see Spiralis. Um, I would assume Voltaics, possibly Loopers, maybe even Kalos Roulettes, maybe <clears> one <throat> of them from the Turbo. Well, those. Well, those are the exotics. They wouldn't come back as a very rare. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying if... Because there has to be two more exotics in a next player's choice crate. Yeah, I, but like I said, man, I wouldn't be surprised to see the nippers come back because they are a pretty solid wheel regardless. I don't see anyone picking uh, some Yuzos. But uh, as for that, yeah, I honestly, I want to see this, the nippers come back. It would actually be a pretty solid uh, wheel to have to come back. Um, now, as for the exotics, that's where it's going to get tricky because are they going to bring back? Are they going to keep the Dracos and the Zombas? Are they going to trade out the Dracos with you know maybe some white hypnotics? Like you know, I would hope not. I mean, the hypnotics are a pretty solid wheel, but you have to get them a very specific color for them to actually look really, really good. Uh, the colors that you're really looking at, anyways, are always going to be the top colors. You're always going to be looking at the crimson, the sky blue, the white, and the black. Those are always going to be the top dog colors when it comes to pretty much anything in the game. Mm -hmm. But I know for specifically those wheels, those are like the best ones. And maybe the forest green, maybe the lime, they can kind of slide on in there too. But uh, those are definitely some of the best wheels. Very, very nice, clean wheel. Wasn't a big fan of them at first. Unpainted Dracos again. <laughs> Gotta get paint on those. Any colors better than unpainted. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Haven't got much and 62 crates left. Only decent thing we've got is orange hex phase and some unpainted Dracos. Yeah. But that's fine I mean, because we pulled start, the Spectre. But... Oh, nice, nice. It's the first mystery. Real, it's, been a real, it's been a real slow start, but it, you can tell that it's definitely double drop because you've pulled more exotics than uh, most other things that you generally pull in the crates. When you we open them, I remember last time I opened up some crates. Want to take a Ooh. guess on which one it is? Ta I want to hope for a tactician. That'd be awesome. I'm not even looking for the striker. I, I actually just prefer tactician over most of my uh, any BMD. It's a little bit of a cheaper thing to acquire when it comes to the the BMDs or higher items, and it's also just a nice tactician because it's based off of um, clears that you do in the game rather than uh, your actual shots on goal. Because I know a lot of people are more or less playing goalie rather than the striker because maybe some people aren't don't have the mechanical skill to do so well I don't mind because that specter is sweeper that's also very good I forgot what that cert is what back is to do? back mysteries uh, you just got back to back mysteries bro a hexed also sir hey, you know what you're building your way up you're building your way up man next gonna be a 20 xx and then you're gonna get a heat <laughs> oh, I have to check what that hexed is certified Again, sweeper. Oh my god. Back-to-back -back mysteries. 
both sweeper. What does that sweeper cert do? I cannot remember. Clears. It's clears too? Wow. On my previous cradle I, I got back to back mysteries because I got Spectre then Bubbly. Wow. Am I confusing Sweeper with Tactician? I probably Tactician am. Tactician is centers. There you go. Okay, centers and then one's clears. Gotcha. I couldn't remember Ooh. for the life of me. Painted Septums. We've had a good three crates. Crimson Septums certified? Well, there's our new wheels that we're keeping. Wow. Back-to-back -back bangers. That's three bangers in a row. I, It's annoying to check these certs every time, but... When it's a good cert, or when it's a good item, there, there's your tactician, Alex. Tactician, Crimson ah, Septums. Ah. Honestly, the, I actually am a big fan of the Septums. At one point, I was actually collecting the set. Wow. Those are three really good pulls. I am not declining that at all. Makes up for the garbage we had in the start. Yeah, well, you also have to realize, man, because of the double drop, that you actually have seen an increase in the drops of the exotics, because I think you said you've, what, you've gotten three or four exotics, I think there were all Dracos. Yeah. But I mean, most times when you open crates, even when you're opening like 30 to 40 crates, without the double drop or the double paint, usually you're looking at maybe only opening one to two exotics and something like that, unless you just have, you know, mind-blowing luck. Mm -hmm. Very rare. Yeah, there is certainly an effect on this, with the difference there. Close to a heat wave, but landed on a Shisa. Fifty-seven PCC left. Still yet for painted exotic. There is trade-ups. It's obviously not as fun though. Creating a painted exotic is certainly a lot better. But geez, four straight imports there. We got a ZSR. That's good, that's good. That'll go right to the trade-ups for those Zombas or Dracos. A Shibuya. Well, I'm never a breakout player, and the only rare decal I play with is Lone Wolf. Yeah. Well, uh, this is going to be definitely the wrong crate for you to be opening if you're looking for a lone wolf. You're going to be looking for the lone wolves in the overdrive crates, which no one wants. <laughs> That's why they're so low. Uh, the lone want, wolf, oh, the white lone wolf is probably more than Hellfire. Uh, lone wolf actually is more than Hellfire. Hellfire is uh, selling for around 5 to $6, while the wolf, lone wolf is sitting at a constant 8 to $10. Well, we're back to the garbage streak again, getting more rares. Hey, well, you gotta think about it, man. You got, <clears throat> you got some garbage, you got some great stuff, and then you, you got some garbage again. So hopefully it's gonna hit you again with some great stuff. Maybe a little more garbage and then some more great stuff, and then you'll end out with, like, a big banger or something. I'm hoping that's what's gonna what happen. What you get hope for. A man can dream. Going into this, White Zomba's the possibility, White Draco's. Obviously, there's big stuff to pull out of this. That's why the player's choice is such a great crate. Remember the last time I opened up Player's Choice crates when we all thought it was going to be Double Paint Weekend and I opened up uh, Black Dracos and the picture, I could have swore they were white and I almost lost my mind and then I found out they were black. I mean, I wasn't too disappointed, but at the same time, wish they were white. Dominus decal. Sure, sure. Getting a long streak <clears> of <throat> Just going to make sure my... Uh... Painted looks sky blue to me. Certified on that. Still going straight honestly, to trade-ups. With, <clears throat> with all the rares you've been getting, man, honestly, uh, you're probably going to be getting quite a few painted septums, but the only thing is, though, do you trade up those painted septums in hopes of getting more imports for the big the big boy trades, or do you just keep the septums they're painted? Certainly the crimson ones I'm keeping. I think, I think you just keep black, white, or crim, right? I think that's what you go for. Yeah. I, I already keep, have a set I think of you just keep those cobalt. and trade up the rest. Yeah, I would think so. Just those top colors. 
A long streak of rares here with 49 left. Hey, you're, not, you're almost halfway through, and I mean, you've done pretty well. You have two black markets already. Yeah. A lot of rares. Most most people don't even see a black market in a hundred crates. You got two, and back to back. I'm not complaining. I'm just complaining of what we're currently getting. No, that's understandable, man. I opened 80 crates like you one time. Oh, I swear, I think I only landed on rares. Rares and very rares. I didn't land. I don't think I landed on a single uh, exotic or import. You definitely have much better crate luck than I do. I will. I will admit that. I'm looking for those painted exotics. Oh, whoops. Pushed B instead of A. Little mistake there. 47 left. We're still yet to get painted exotic. What we need? Oh, let's hope. Uh, I'm gonna well, say not really these next 10 on crates. color right now, but. Any paint. Honestly, honestly, I'm thinking. You know, I got a feeling within these next tech, uh, next ten crates, you're gonna get something pretty decently painted. Something sky blue, something white. I already got a crimson pull, so they might be a little generous to give me crimson dracos. Hey, you know what? That'd be a uh, Alex. You called it. Good. <clears throat> What'd you grab? Actually, you know what? Don't even tell me. I want to see it for myself. Hope it's something good, right? Hey, look at that. I think that's Cobalt Zamas, aren't they? Yep. Hey, I had a feeling, man. I had a feeling. And you know what? Cobalt look really good. The funny thing is, Cobalt and Sky Blue, if you actually look at them side by side, they're actually really, really identical to one another. Some Septums. That's certainly going for trade up since there's no paint. Hey, now we're just looking for uh, some maybe uh, painted exotic Dracos, maybe to yeah spice things up a little bit because as there, I think as everyone knows when it comes to any sort of trading or anything like that, the uh, Dracos overall hold value much higher than the Zombas. Besides, when it comes to the white and black Zombas. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Aside from that, the uh... overall. Yeah. If you if you straight up pair up every color of Draco to every color of Zamba, almost every color of Draco beats out every color of Zambas besides when it comes to the white and black. Yep. I don't think I've had Cobalt Zambas before, so that'll be on my list of what I've owned. So currently I have three painted Zambas I have now, Cobalt, Orange, and Burnt Sienna. It just sucks that you have like two of the lower end Spectrum ones, the orange and burnt Santa. Yeah, we're gonna change that. Rolling for big bucks. I'm really just excited. <clears throat> I just want to see something white pop up on this screen. We got lag. Those are painted septums. You know what color? Orange. Certified. Still gonna stick with the Zombas on the top wheel. Yeah, that's well, just... <clears throat> that is the top wheel for sure. We'll have a look at what cert? Sweeper again? Wow. Three sweeper items. Hey, Holy. now you just need a... Uh, hey, pull some uh, white Zombas with the sweeper cert on them, you know? Let's get it. <laughs> or Dracos. Any now that would be on this row here. Draco Zombas Heat. Any on that row. Except those two have to have paint. Oh. <clears throat> You're halfway through, man. 40 more to go, and you've gotten some pretty good stuff so far. Better oh, than I can say I've ever gotten from these crates. Another For import. 40 crates down, you've gotten painted exotics, you got a couple imports, two pairs of painted septums, and two black markets. That's really good. And, uh, orange hex phase.
Need a good pull here. Shibuya. Damn. You're this you're rather spinning your car around in the video, man, and it's making me dizzy. <laughs> 38 to go. Looking for painted Dracos. Ideally, that isn't orange because I already have them. But we're getting more rares. It's just up and down. No certification on that. I don't care if there is on rares. <coughs> big money, big money. Octane decal. Honestly, I think in the if they bring back a player's choice crate, I actually think they will be bringing the uh, Octane Lone Wolf into it. I wouldn't mind that at all. Like, the next time they uh, release a player's choice crate with updated uh, items inside of it, they really need to bring it, you know, step it up and uh, put in some banger items to where, like, you don't feel like you lost when you open it no matter what you get, whether it be a rare decal or, you know, a black market. Yep. It's going to be harder with some of those other cars. Because they they can't just have only Octane decals. They're going to have to have Sentio decal, um something for werewolf <coughs> maybe something well, for breakout been, uh, i believe there's been a crate or two where they've actually had uh two octane two... decals yeah oh sorry about the sneeze well there is um, a yeah, the pcc two because decals. there's the octane shisa and then the octane mg88 now they're different rarities but there's still two of the same car within one crate yeah honestly i think if uh, it comes to Decals for cars, they should uh, have the Octane, the Dominus for sure, because it's definitely one of the uh, big cars that's used. Um, and, you know, I'm not really too much of a big fan of the uh, the Werewolf or the uh, Samurai, but, I mean, that'd probably be one of the other two decals to probably go in there. Probably be the best bet, because those are the two newest cars that we really haven't seen many decals for. Yeah, yeah, yeah I have a point on that. Another Octane decal. Yeah, I'm really uh, hoping they put the uh, a Lone Wolf into the player's choice crate. That'd be really nice. That's certainly within the top two favorite Octane decals. I like the Slimline too, but not as much as the Lone Wolf. And honestly, for the black markets, <clears throat> when it comes to the player's choice crate, now I don't know how they're going to do anything with the uh, player's choice crate when it comes to the goal explosions because that's something that has never been featured inside of a player's choice crate before because this one that you're opening currently came out actually before um, goal explosions were introduced to the game. So with that being said, do you think they might incorporate some sort of goal explosion picked by the fans? I would hope that they wouldn't. I, I mean, I think everyone would hope that they wouldn't, but if you if you... You know, they're probably going to include like three black market decals and then probably one goal explosion. If you had to pick a goal explosion, which one do you think they should bring back? I'm not too sure. Atomizer has been too fresh. Uh, it's too new out of the crate. I like the dueling dragons. I don't mind that too much. I personally really like Sub-Zero, but I don't think too much of the community does. So, I'm not too sure which one, but I'd say probably Dueling Dragons. Yeah, I think I, I, think I would go for probably the Dueling Dragons, or, uh... Oh, there's another one I'm thinking. I can't think of it. Uh, Dueling... Yeah, probably Dueling Dragons, Sub-Zero, or Polypop would be my three picks to have in any, in the, uh, slot if they do one. Now, for Mystery Decals, that's a whole another story, because... You know, now we're faced with a bunch of new ones that we just got. We just got Dissolver. We got, you know, the Stormwatch, the Trigon, the Chameleon. <clears throat> so, and we also, you know, we got the other older ones that we've had in the game for quite a long time now. Three, you know, three mystery decals. What, what do you want to see in that crate if it comes out? Heatwave, Bubbly... Oh, probably Slipstream. 
You want to see heat wave bubbling in the slip? And that's just because you're going with like the older style of the decals? Or are yeah. you including every decal? No, that's including all of them. I'm debating between the heat wave and dissolver. Honestly, if it came to the player's choice crate, I would not be opposed to seeing heat wave, dissolver, and then having maybe uh, a chameleon. Okay. Or even stormwash. Stormwatch is a very underrated mystery decal. Not many people like it because it's not really in your face, but it's real nice and subtle. And if you put it with a nice car and you just get the design looking right and you get the colors on point, it just makes for such a nice decal to have on your car if you're really into using mystery decals. Like it's very subtle, very clean. You know, personally, I'm not even that big of a fan of the heat wave. It's just, it doesn't really have an in your face thing. It's not super subtle. And it's just, <clears throat> honestly, it's not the nicest decal in the game. I'd probably swap out the heat wave for a bubbly, actually. I really like probably bubbly. Do a bub I'd probably do the bubbly dissolver and then uh, a storm watch. I think that would probably be one of the nicest black market uh, combinations I have in that crate. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I don't, if I had I don't know if I can agree with though, you on the Stormwatch, but I like the ideal of Chameleon, so I'd say Bubbly Dissolver Chameleon. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was saying if, uh, if I had to swap out the Stormwatch, though, for another one, I'd probably have to go with the Chameleon. That'd probably be the only uh, way I would actually really uh, think about doing it. God, could you imagine if they took, like, non-crate imports or non-crate exotics or non-crate rares or something like that and stuck them into some sort of crate? community wouldn't like that because <clears throat> then what crate oh, would the octane well, because... go into no idea but that would be very interesting Let's see what would happen so how many crates you got left on you 21 21 I've been too focused on uh, talking about possible PCC choices with you and a bunch of other things. I haven't actually really noticed what uh, anything that you've been pulling. Is it uh, anything decent or did I miss anything good? Last crate we got a Crimson Hex phase and a pink Takumi sticker bomb right now. Okay. I so saw you far, just barely miss on that 20XX. Out of 60 crates, we haven't got painted Jerico's. That's a little sad for Double Paint Weekend. If it wasn't, then that's expected. For Painted Zombas, we've got Cobalt. For Painted Hex Phase, we got Guardian Purple, Crimson, we got the Orange. For Septums, we got Crimson. Unpainted Draco's again. A Sweeper Spectre, a Sweeper Hexed. Super Crimson Septums. Or no, Tactician Crimson Septums, aren't they? Yep. We're still working on painted Dracos. They're just being a little too stubborn. Maybe they'll only let us get them in a trade up. But another import is another import towards a trade up. Looks like I might be starting the Septiment Hex Phase set. <laughs> a PCC crate only set? Yeah. Discs they open so many. Another import, I like that. 17 crates and 17 keys left. She's a decal. Never gonna use that. I don't think I've ever worn a Shisa. There's a good reason behind that. Yeah, it's just not a very good decal. Same with the Octane ZSR Jangshi. Pretty sure that's from the Nitro series, and you get a lot of that. I have quite a few Jangshis, I think three or four painted variants. 
Yeah, I had a quite a bit of those too. If you actually, you know, honestly, if you just uh, take the time and actually really mess with some colors, you could probably make all those decals work for the octane. A gray hex phase. So okay. it could really wants to give me the set. It really wants to give me the set. I'm pretty sure that's gray. Nope, it's not gray. Titanium white. Woohoo! I already had black before, and I already had gray. Now I have two white. Wow. I swear that was gray. Holy. But I already had black and gray before this, so I can guarantee that's white. Wow. We're hitting, yeah, every sure. we're hitting everything but the painted Dracos. And you could you could tell that uh that was just brand new that you just got it just because you could uh when you were going into your inventory you could see like the little uh notification yeah, of a yeah. new item in your inventory. Breakout decal. Fourteen PCC to go. We got both the low end mysteries. Got some painted zombies. A good amount of imports. Quite a few hex phase and quite a few septums. Too many rares. We're working on painted Dracos still. 14 crates to go. <clears throat> we gotta get at least one pair of painted Dracos. They're just waiting to give me Either that or money. another mystery. She's a decal. Wrong thing. Wrong item to give me. If they won't get painted Dracos, at least get more painted Zombas. Got a little bit of leg. It's gonna be a painted Narwhal Deco, or a certification. Either. <laughs> 12 to go. Praying we get painted Dracos. Start off strong and it's kinda ending weak. It needs to it needs to throw a banger in your face or it's just waiting for the trade ups. If there isn't a banger at the end, I'm gonna be scared. Hoping that they're gonna leave me with a big one to end it off. The closest thing we've got to white is just a white hex phase, which I'm not complaining about. Because white is an awesome color, but it needs to be on the wheels. Yeah, definitely going to give you a dumbass wheels. Hey, at least, you, at least you don't have a, you know, John Sandman luck, man. <laughs> yeah. He got he got ruined by those triumph crates when they came when they came out. He opened a hundred and got nothing. Then again, the PC market is a lot cheaper than what these could have sold for. Oh yeah, for sure. Because of the double paint, these crates right now are costing about a buck fifty a piece, sometimes two dollars a piece right now. <clears throat> you see, these things are still only costing you like 20 cents a crate. Gotten quite a few of the MG88 decals. Seven to go. We're still working on painted Dracos. It's all about those trade-ups, man. You need at least two painted exotic trade-ups for it to be all right. A four screen Dominus decal. Never gonna use that. I never play with Dominus. Tried with it a bit in training mode, I just couldn't get a handle on it. Painted septums again. Okay. I don't mind black septums. <clears throat> it says you have 
It says you got five beers in here. We got a. Uh, oh, we got blue. I believe is in here. Giving little shoutouts, are you? <clears throat> uh, maybe a little, but uh, what symptoms are those? Is this the gray ones? Black ones? I can't tell. Black. Oh, that's a weird color for black ones. Not bad though. Yeah, see, uh, yeah. Well, the reason I know is I know it's blue is just because the the last part of his name is uh, Snow Veg. Or I don't know how you actually pronounce it. Not sure who the other guys are, but certainly appreciate watching though. Yeah, for sure. I had no idea there was other people in the stream. Actually, I didn't notice. I was too focused on talking with you and uh, definitely watching to see if you get anything good. Just waiting for those trade ups, man. That's what I can't wait for. It's not as fun to get good trade-up items, but creating them is real fun. Regardless, still getting something good. We might go 80 crates without getting painted Dracos. On a double painted weekend. Second last PCC. Those narwhal decals love you today, man. Put some paint on this hex phase. They love giving paint in hex phase. I jinxed it. Crap. <laughs> Was at least certified. Nothing. Bare bones. Last player's choice crate. If they're waiting for the big banger, now is the time to have it. If they're just gonna give me a narwhal decal, then it was a waste of a key. Yeah, for sure. Did I not call it that I wasted a key? Did you get a narwhal? Wow. So now trade-ups. The way we're going to do this is that I'm trading up almost everything in my inventory. Then we're going to move on to the PCC trade-ups that we can do. So this is going to be all of the random stuff that I can possibly trade up. Which includes these Jiangxi decals from the rares from the Nitro series. And no decal, no paint. Nothing from Santa series. Obviously can't trade up crates, that'd be pretty cool if he could. Some non-crate imports that we can trade up. It's almost sad to see all those Jangshis just now go, man, just because of the fact that the Jangshis actually look kind of cool because you had a bunch of different paints and color ones. Crap. I'm surprised. I'm surprised in your um opening you didn't uh, have any uh temptation to uh trade up um the what do you call it or open up the uh, CC4 crates. Not much. I don't want to get stuck with errors. Being stuck with errors would be just a terrible thing. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. A little so. trade up here from the Turbo Series. Kalos and Roulettes. Just paint it. Just paint them. I'm concerned, Alex. Ooh. Let's get rid of the normal banner. Keep the cat ears. Straight up, so looking a little bit rough there. They're not too good. One short on the accelerator rares. Have some old PCC distortions. Want that catfish painted?
We're not looking too good for trade-ups. I'm a little concerned. <clears throat> well, these are just the non-crates, so... So you got the player's choice, and that's where your uh, bangers are going to be headed. If they're not giving me good ones now, what if we don't get good ones in the PCC trade-ups? Oh, well, that's on PCC. Let's hope we get some good stuff. I'm hoping we do. We didn't have too much for big bangers from from those PCC openings. I'm pretty sure we can do a CC3 trade up. Yeah, we can. So this will be interesting. Is that I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's Discos and Pulses. So this is a bit of an odd trade up to do because there isn't too many of these imports left. And this is a really underrated crate. People only like the exotics, if that really. So let's see what we get. No well, point. Are you <clears throat> kidding me? Yeah, well, I mean, the pulses are pretty nice. Uh, I like the purple ones, uh, personally. Uh, but when it comes to the Disco the Qs, everyone calls them Disco Techs. They're actually, it's actually pronounced Disco the Q, if you didn't know. Well, I call it Disco Tech. Holy, look how many everyone does, and Octane but, decals. Yeah, it's funny, because those wheels, I forgot what their, what their name like that for. Uh, but it's based off of something, but they're actually pronounced Disco the Q, but I know those uh, go for quite a bit if you get them in the white. Otherwise, they're uh, not too popular. Yeah. Pretty sure that's it for outside of the player's choice. Might be able to do a trade-up with these. Garrett of Uncle Sam, ideally if I don't have to do the steg. <coughs> there we go. Keep the orange sterns in case they're not needed. Dendritic banner. Not too happy with that, but. There was one more possible trade up we can do. Pretty sure it was the top hats. And then we can move on to the PCC ones, and then I have one surprise one to do after that I was banking up. I'm hoping that I have enough for them. I can't remember if I was just shy. A fishbowl topper? Well, regardless, we're moving on to the PCCs trading these up starting with these okay so this is gonna be a trade locked item used it with the decryptor dominus decal don't tell me I'm gonna have to restart this every time it's a lot more efficient on PC We need more <clears> player's <throat> yeah, sure. choice rares here. So many MTGAs. Good call. Good call on definitely keeping the M uh, some of the painted MTGAs. Really? Yeah, I know Dominus players who love them. Well, there's no Takumi players, so we're gonna trade up a bunch of sticker bomb. I do see, uh, believe it or not, in competitive, I actually see a lot of people using Takumis for some reason. I don't know if that's just to uh, rub it in if you get beat by them. Uh, that they beat you with the one of the ugliest cars probably possible. Or, uh, nah, just because I'd it's say actually Gizmo's a car they there. like to look of. Uh, I mean, if you really want to play it like that, man, you got the Scarab, and then you got that other one that looks like it has little fangs on the front of it. trade-ups are going terrible that's how we're gonna put this just leave it blunt terrible trade-ups <clears throat> well you haven't gotten to the big boy stuff yet
we got a score, Sky Blue Dominus Decal. Actually keep that. Cause it's worth more than what we're getting in trade ups. Wow. This is disgusting. There better be a big banger at the end of this because we have gotten nothing in trade ups. No snow edge that there's no Takumi meta. It will never be a thing. Well, we're getting not. rid of the full Merc Narwhals here. Painted Sufferance. Wow. Wow. Nothing. This is just hard to deal with. That is a lot of Narwhals. See, the point is that we've gotten too many. It's not even possible to get that painted, so why would you give it to me? Because that guy's one comment where it's like a Dorito chip and it looks like a Twitch energy drink or something like that. It just makes me think of like people who drive in the Takumi sweating their balls off inside of a competitive in like the diamond area playing with Takumi. It just makes me think that they're sitting there munching on some like nacho cheese Doritos with a big jug of like G Fuel next to them, some monster and you know a sweat towel next to their <laughs> Finally we got something painted. Aviator purple, okay. At least we didn't have that color. Took a long time to get something painted though, holy. Pretty sure this is gonna be the so last- So for double drop? <laughs> Get rid of the ominous decal. There we go. Last PCC for a trade up. Painted hex face, please. Wow, and then I realize that then you still got a. Uh... So we have some very rares now. I. Yeah. We know we're not getting anything painted. I already know that walking into this. Because you can't get these imports painted. Striker but snakes. You're hoping for certification. Not actually. Certification, don't really care about. Four unpainted septums and. An unpainted hex phase. Yes. Certified type S. I don't care too much with. What's from the Turbo series? Not trading up my white septums, nope. Full snakeskin set. It's not gonna be anything painted, so I'm not praying for anything. It's just praying that I get an import and that the game doesn't just glitch out and give me another very rare. Yeah, hopefully. So now it's coming down to what do we want to keep. For sure I'm wanting to keep the distortions, that's guaranteed. Can get rid of this. That, that. Um... I think that looks good to me, yeah. We still have quite a few. That striker. <clears throat> the striker snakeskin. Mm hmm. Decrypted. That's all. Pretty sure this is the last very rare trade up. We're gonna have to trade it up. I'm not doing the distortions. Pretty sure we have to. The distortions, what do you mean? The two distortions here from the old PCC set. So I'm just hanging on to them in the event that they go up. I really don't think they will, and honestly, if you really need another pair, I'm sure someone will be more than happy to give them back to you. Well, then we'll get rid of that. 
This is the big money. The last set of trade-ups. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Two PCC trades. Yeah, you definitely, you definitely don't want to have a decrypted item going into it because if you get a, you know, if you get a import, it automatically goes into being a decrypted item. So if you traded up a decrypted item into like, you know, some like really cool painted Zombas or Dracos, yeah, they're permanently decrypted. And that's just because of one decrypted item that got traded up. Well, three, four, six, seven, twelve, fourteen, seventeen, twenty. If, if That's just trading any, up with the I decrypted. So we can do if four I suggest trade anything, If I suggest anything in one, in one trade up alone, do the decrypted. Take all your decrypted item, all yep. your decrypted items, and just hope it's nothing good, and then hope the rest is all great. Big money coming up here. Painted Dracos, please. This is what we've been waiting for. I'll just ignore seeing anything with that. Ooh, Scorer and Striker Dominus GT. Jeez, the two best certs. Still getting rid of them though. Yes! Finally! Don't say anything. Finally! Those get equipped instead of the zombies. Uh, oh, four screen Dracos! Let's get it, boy! Second last trade up. I want to get painted zombies in a trade up. We need better. Than what our trade-up luck has been. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh. What? Can I do another CC3 trade-up? Or I'll see one, okay. Mm, did you do your last trade-up already? This is going to be the last coming up here. I don't know which car. Yeah, ZSR. Full ZSRs. Last PCC trade up. We need a good pull here. to say to that let's just check the cert oh. oh no I got scammed again <laughs> great it's in a flight <laughs> damn dude I bet you were like so excited for a second when you saw that and then you realized it was gray so, oh, that sucks, I'm pretty dude. sure I'm one short. Crap. Crap. Oh well. Dude, but I mean, hey, you know, at least all your painted came at the trade up, so I mean, at least they, you know, they came around. Damn. So, God. to make hey, our just good be glad looking card, wasn't. Just be glad that, that, uh, cert wasn't striker. Because then you'd be super salty that they weren't white. Hey, at least uh, your decrypted items didn't give you anything good, so... You gotta decrypt the Draco that you can't use. I actually like that Spectre with the white, that white color on it, honestly. The white secondary. They actually look really, really solid. And we got a purple. That's not gonna work. We gotta go. Yeah. So that's our car of what we got. We got four screen Dracos, Spectre, 
certified sweeper. We got a sweeper hex. To me, when you said Dracos, it sounded funny. It sounded like you said, we got certified Dwaycos. <laughs> like you were special needs. <laughs> we, we got, we got Cobalt Thrombus, and we got scammed and got oh. Grey Area to Thrombus. So, we got, thank you we guys. Got boys. We thank got you boys, for green Dwaycos and in. Zombies. It's the shits. We got grey instead of white. White on the last trade up would have been incredible. But thank you to everyone that was watching. Hope you enjoyed. That's what 80 players choice crates looks like on double painted weekend. And then trade ups afterward. So thank you for watching. Hope you guys have a good one. And enjoy your double paint weekend.